I've been I've been having an absolute blast of this. Save Luigi 3.3. Save Luigi version three. All right, we're ready to go. All right, now where is this question block? Oh, wait, it's up there. How do I get up there? I didn't see that. Yeah, it was my fucking CRT. Like, cause so you guys can see a little bit more of the game than I can. So that means I definitely have missed other ones, probably. I don't I don't think I can do this. It's an awfully short level. Yeah, some of the levels are really short. Um I don't I don't think that's a bad thing. Oh fuck. Oh, Pog Champ! Oh, fucking shit! First segment of the code EF3. Alright, alright, alright. This is good. This is good. Okay, so level six. What is this? Level six is question block. Level six is question block. What if it's a Mario Maker code? Fuck, dude, I bet it is a Mario Maker code. Oh. Question block six, yeah, I got that. So we need to find the last, the last part of the code. You can see some grass up there. I don't remember seeing a pipe up there yesterday. I definitely saw a pipe up there yesterday. I see the grass, but... Well, there you go. There you go. We saw the pipe. There's definitely a pipe up there. I wish I had more attempts at this. That's definitely it. K7K7G. K7G. All right, that's what we wanted. Boom. Okay. All right, it's I think it's definitely a Mario Maker 2 code. This is all this is all a this is all a big plot. This whole thing is just one big plot to get me to play a shitty fucking Mario Maker level. Watch it not even be a fucking code for Mario Maker though. That's that's my big worry. If it's not a code for Mario Maker, then I'm like, I have no idea what I'm gonna do because I don't know what else it could be. You have three, three, and nine, A seven G. Searching for courses and makers. Use this level to access the secret exit and navigate through the dark room. Save Luigi, Haunted Manor. They know this is definitely it. Definitely it. Pog. Pog.
Oh man. This is cool. Why you make hard? Why you make level hard? Fuck, it's so hard to go in there. No, you can get out of emote only now. Yeah, you can get out of emote only now for now. It's so hard going back and forth between the two games. I'm in, I'm in Mario World mode. A green screen? Oh my god, dude. We're going right back to... Wish him call it in two seconds. Relax, my dude. It's too loud now. Too loud. And now this is just right. Missing out on some good streamers, my dude. Yeah, let's check the comments. You're required high poo, high poo. <laughs> check the sixth cloud. I'm not seeing any clouds. I didn't see where the Luigi was. I'm going to go back to the thumbnail. Yeah, I'll go back to the thumbnail, guys. I just want to run through this one more time. Um, and I don't think there's anything I'm missing. <gasps> oh, I get it. Okay, I get it. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Okay, cloud five. So L L five, turn block is I seven. Yeah, I'm dumb. That was it was obvious. Turn block. Well, that's not. Yeah, but U isn't in there, guys. U isn't in there. U. Yeah, U isn't in there. Five four. Yeah. Okay. So like, if it goes, if we just go like so. Cloud five. No block. Four, uh, turn block seven. What is this? Was that six and then four or five? Five, four, seven, six, five. That's great and all, but it doesn't really give us anything. This will be a level in the hack, but in the dark, that'll be fucking hard. This made me more confused. Let's go back to this game. Let's go back to this game. Yeah, let's go back to this game. This was uploaded 22320. That was a while ago, dude. The Haunted Manor. Oh shit, this is exactly the same thing. Oh, shit. Oh, I mean, I didn't really, yeah, I didn't really get that. I think there's a hidden pipe. Yeah, I was going to say the hidden pipe is what we're looking at. Oh, my God. All right. This is fucking sick. A grid safety. All right, now we're in a completely different spot here. Grid safety. Super Mario Maker 2. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, okay, okay. All right, hold on. All right. 
Oh shit, this is gonna be hard. Okay. I literally need to go back. I need to go back to this. <laughs> yeah, I need to go back to this. This is this is tough. This is this is fucking amazing. Yeah, this is dope. Okay, so we want to go here and then here. Okay. So let's go there and then Okay, so I just landed on that spike. Okay, so now we need to go Right there. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Just wanna make sure I'm... Fuck. Just wanna make sure I'm doing this right. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm glad I looked because I thought I was gonna shell jump right there. Okay. Okay, now let me go back here. All right, now that, nope, okay, we got this. This is like a multi-stream. I mean, I, I could do it, but there's not really. Okay, now we go. Now we go, oh fuck. hard shit okay i'm too close to the wall it's not too bad it's really not too bad like it's like full jump full jump full jump full jump yeah i missed it come on i have the world record with the graphics yeah and completely different physics engine it's the physics engine which is so hard adjusting adjusting going back and forth between the two is difficult Okay. Okay, now let's go back here. That was embarrassing. That was an embarrassing move. I have Mario Maker behind it. I don't think it would just work perfectly for me. All right, so I wanna just do a little shell jump like that. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. All right, we got this. I did the exact same thing I did on practice. This is so fucking exciting! I don't- it's a question block! Uh, in the grotto, there's ghosts but no houses, wagons but no roads, fingers but no hand. What's special about the grotto? There's ghosts but no houses, wagons but no roads, fingers without the hand. The answer gives you a grid coordinative value. All the first words have G's, but none of the second words have G's. They all have one G. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay. Not it. Not it. When did this open up? When did this open up?
Oh, okay, hold on. Add up Luigi, levels 2, 6, 9, 14. Okay, I didn't find anything in level 14, did I? Add up 5 plus 4 plus 7, 9, 16, 22, 27. So that's 27. Some of the values will give you a grid coordinate value. You must go to... All right, so we're adding up Luigi, and the way we got the value of Luigi was from the Mario Maker level, the screenshot. So that's 27, right? Some of the values will give you a grid coordinated values. You must go to... You must go to 40D, then to coordinate obtained by solving the puzzle. Hit the up button on the said coordinate to enter the castle. So the the two six nine and fourteen. So level two, level two had cloud five. Okay, level two had cloud five. Boom. Level six had cloud six. Level nine had note block four. Level fourteen had turn block seven. Okay, okay. So we have those clues. We found those clues. Okay. All right, we can erase this the segment, the code segment. So that equals twenty seven. I still don't know what grid safety means, but. All right, so we go to 40D and then G27. So that's what we're doing. Going to 40, 40, G, 40D and then, yeah, I'm going to erase this. I don't think this has anything to do with it either. 27, the grotto's special because it has one G or it has two T. Oh my god, so some an on off switch just happened. Did you guys just hear that? And then G27. Yup. Uh. Pog. Pog. That is so good. Where did the G come from? Um, the 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 riddle was that Grotto was special because it had one G in it. Um, like fingers, but no hands. Fingers had one G in it. Ghosts, but no houses. One G in it. Um, and I forgot what the other one, but it only had one G in it. Yeah. Oh, man. You, what made it inside? Well, let's see how well you remember your adventure. <laughs> Wagons, but no roads. Yeah, 1G. 1G and Luigi. Oh, my God. Is this just going to run me through, like, the entire game in one level? How did the back door open? I'm assuming because I beat the Haunted Manor, the back door open. There's a good way to prevent brute forcing. I wish it just started me right here. Oh my god. What's the name of this hack? Save Luigi. Take away the clues and start the timer. Once you beat in a practice room, you will be sent back to the last obtained checkpoint. But I haven't obtained a checkpoint yet. Dude, this is a bit demanding here. Come on, man. I just I just solved your puzzle. Yeah, I just solved your puzzle, dude. The disrespect, I know, right? Oh, come on. 
It's been a while since I've seen a five room castle. Okay, well, at least I have a checkpoint right here. Yeah, overcoming. You don't have to. You don't have to help, man. Let me. Let let me struggle. <laughs> Fair point. Shit! <laughs> Are jokes allowed? Only if they're funny. Don't give me none of that non-funny bullshit. I'm joking. We can unban that guy. It's totally fine. All right. Might, I might as well do the practice door. I'm just going to get sent back to world one anyway. <laughs> well, this is a bit different looking. Skip something in the Yoshi house? I think that it's an interesting tile set. Yay! Level one. I don't think it's done enough to have checkpoints. I, I kind of. As soon as Gren called the throwback to the five room castle she's totally right five room castles they i respect a five room castle so in the original kaizo mario uh one of the signatures is a five room castle and it's actually in a lot of kaizo games they do a five room castle um but most of them don't like you know don't do this where they make you clear all five rooms anymore um most of them give you checkpoints after every room, but uh, like Dram World, you have to do all five rooms at once, you know? Does Kaizo still make ROM hacks? Wait, what? There's not a human named Kaizo. Yeah, Kaizo means rearranged in Japan. Uh, the guy who made Kaizo 1 is named Takamito. Tony Takamato. Yeah, Kaizo, what do you mean? Kaizo Man might be in chat right now, guys. There should be a guy named Kaizo. I'm gonna change my name. Joe Kaizo. Yeah, Joe Kaizo. That bitch Carol Baskins. Uh, me thinks it might be broke. I don't want to die. I was definitely going to one shot this section. Why are we even, why are we even debating that? 100% was going to one shot this section, guys. Come on. Come on. Why is this even a debate? You know it. I know it. We all know I was going to one, one shot this section.
Um, we we had. Oh, you're just starting me at world four. Is it was that on purpose? Over common? You didn't have to do that. Or does world or does four have another? That's all right. We're just going with it. We're just going with it. Let's not worry about it. Let's not let's not ask questions. Oh shit, I need to go fast. He knew I was about to one shot it. Yeah, he gave me credit for the one shot. Dude, Barb, it made like top it was in the top um We were in the top fifteen games at that point. Yeah, it was wild. I'd imagine when Grand Pooh World 3 comes out, I mean we might we might crack. Grand Pooh World 3 and Invictus 2 could both crack, you know, like some incredible numbers for sure. Whoops, I died. Yeah, I mean I, I'm excited about just to see where SMW will be for that day. Grand Pooh World 2's, Grand Pooh World 3 is going to make some new partners. And that would be pretty fucking cool. Anytime a game can make new partners. Alright, made it. Made it. Alright, alright. Five. Yeah, I don't remember this level at all. <laughs> What do you need to be partnered? A big dick. Yeah, I mean, it, it'll be, you know, I mean, the thing with the release day, I'm going to stream as soon as I wake up. The Infamous, thank you for 37 months. Uh, Surname, thank you for eight months. Death Adder, the Lamas. I mean, but, you know, we're talking about, we're talking about a year from now. Yeah, I'm excited to see how high, how high we can bring the SMW. But either way, it's still not going to be Valorant numbers. The embargo ends. Yeah, I think I'm going to play tomorrow. And the embargo ends. I think mine ends Friday. Yeah. But it might, it might, I might get to like, you know, claim the whole Australia thing. common hey hey buddy i'm a play tester now i play tested his hack and his mario maker level you're totally right oh this has been really fun today i've had this is i've been i've been having an absolute blast of this save luigi 3.3 an absolute blast of this today yeah onward hit me like super deep like onward as a dad was i i, I first of all i had no expectations for onward um and oh my fucking god it was so good i couldn't get over it got some got some dad cries out of it yeah it's on disney plus that's got a got a few dad tears out of me man for sure like after we watched it i was like all right we gotta make we gotta make boy a brother Right?
All right, through. <sighs> All right, so it looks like every three. Motor skills is to be activated. You can also spawn. Okay. Oh, man, you really want me to do this shit again? Uh, this is gonna be tough. If I gotta beat this level... And then... Yeah, if I gotta beat this level and then a whole nother thing, that's gonna... Like, if I gotta go 7, 8, 9, that's gonna be tough. Stop searching for salmon when I got married. Wait, you call women salmon? How's that working out for you? Oh. Uh... Oh, come the fuck on! Wrestling needs an audience. Eh. Does it help? Yes. Is it 100% necessary all the time? I would argue that there's a lot of cool stuff you can do. No! There you go. Oh my god, dude, just give me a fucking Just give me a fucking checkpoint after every one of these man or like every two. Oh Man oh, I didn't even hit the fucking checkpoint like that part <laughs> difficulty of snowboarding I get the fourth time I'll be super happy no it's not I, I literally have no happiness right now because I then I have to just go through I, I don't get to it's not it's nothing it means absolutely nothing all I get to do is see the next section now I'm still gonna have to beat the next section combined with this section all at one time See, now I have to go back here. Um... I love, I loved this game up until, very, literally up until this point. <laughs> and then I'm like, fuck this. <laughs> I've been traumatized.
Yay, now I get the right to die here. Awesome. Point of advice, if you hold spin mid jump, you will change to a spin jump and not use your double jump. What? Motor skills and double jump are activated? What? There's not a checkpoint or a practice store for this. This is new fucking shit. I swear to God, if it puts me back. No. All right. I can't do it. Did you, did, did you lose? No, I'm not doing it. That's new. It's a brand new thing. You don't give me every practice. Come on. Oh, the puzzle's so good. I want to finish it. So what if it's the last room? Why do you want to, why do you want to make the player pissed off right before they're about to finish the game? <laughs> I'm raging because I love the hack. Yes, I'm mad because I like this a lot. And it, it's putting, it's putting something that's like, a, a something that doesn't, uh, like a weird gate right at the end. No, the game's, the game's fucking awesome. It's a really great fucking game. Yeah, it's a really great fucking game, but you can't, you can't, you can't drop like a brand new mechanic with no practice door in the last room. I had accepted the practice door, go back to the beginning thing. I, I had accepted it. I wasn't happy about it, but I accepted it, right? I accepted it but right at the end, like, oh man, but I can't stop dying if I don't know, you know, if the, the sections I to learn and I need to learn. Or if I could actually you can probably soft block and jump in the nine. Oh, fucking Can I recap the puzzle? Okay. So there were three codes spread throughout the game, right? There were there was a beginning code, a middle code, and an end code. They each had three digits in them. All right? Here, I'll bring up the notepad. They each had three digits in them. These three codes led to this Mario Maker level. Uh, now this Mario Maker level, the second half of this Mario Maker level right here, uh, is built the exact same way that you have to run through another level. So you, play, you beat this level, Right, and then you run through another level completely blind in Mario World, but it's set up just like this. So you have to follow this set design in Mario World, like in the Mario World level, right? So you beat that, and then you get access to, um, at, you have to add up Luigi. And the way you get access to how you add up Luigi uh, is you go to four certain levels, and you get a number value a number value so the note block is four the turn block is or the note block is you <laughs> sorry sorry the question block is six the note block is four the turn block is seven the cloud is five right if you go here if you look right there luigi right so it's five four seven six five if you add that up that gets 27. You got 27, right? Then you go into another room, opens up the back door, and it gives you a riddle. You solve that riddle, and you get the letter G. So G27 ends up putting you where you need to go. And then here I am in this spot. Yes. Here we go. Okay, I got it. If you would have just given them the practice door, I think that would have been like you did everywhere else. That would have been acceptable. Oh, 
over common, the best the best thing, I know you're young, but the best the best thing you can ever do is never worry about hard. Never ever ever worry about hard. Worry about fun. The the fun if it's difficult, it it needs to be fun difficult. Does that make sense? I think that's the biggest problem all new creators have in Mario Maker. Anytime they get into Kaizo, they think hard equals fun. Hard does not equal fun. They're not the same thing. You're not leaving alive. This time you will die. All right, here we go. Here we go, baby. Oh. Just hoping for a different boss. Yeah. Do I have to kill the shells too? I can't step on him. Read the text box in the other room? I did. You can spawn throw blocks using L or R. Oh, okay. You can't kill him with. Yeah, you can't kill this. You see how the. Oh, did he just get frozen? Alright. So... Wait, can you jump on him too? Damn it. Damn it. Oh, I like the music a lot. there I feel like that was it how many times did we hit him right there Oh my god. <laughs> Woo! Toads, Mario, how did you... I mean, Mario, we are so happy to see you. What? Is this a plot twist? Oh, I wouldn't go in there. Princess's orders. She said she wants to keep you safe. Mario, wait. How did the how did Peach contact you? And where the hell is Bowser? I want to fuck that bitch up. Wait, this is what Mario's saying. <laughs> wait, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. How did the Peach contact you? And where the hell is a Bowser? I want to fuck her that bitch up. I want to fuck that bitch up. Toads. <laughs> um. The princess told me not to tell, but not coming from me. She's two rooms down. Toads. Mario, wait. Brace yourself. Good luck. Thanks, guys, but I don't think I will need it. I have busted this guy's ass like 45 times. <laughs>
Toadette. Mario, how'd you get here? I mean, I'm glad you got here safe. Toadette whispering. Jeez, the toads are useless. This has got some fucking lore going on here, y'all. This has got serious lore. Why is everyone so surprised to see me? I feel like I've proved myself time and time again. I guess we are all a bit shaken up by your abrupt arrival. Another thing, how come you are just standing around while Bowser is in the next room? The toads are scared of mere Goombas. You think they can handle Bowser? Ah, uh, fair, but I do need to get going to my princess and my brother are being held hostage, as you know, as you all seem to know. Mario, wait. If you go through that door, you will be up against something you've never fought before. I will be a fine, uh, trust me. Another thing, how did you get past our security? I mean, the couplings. Wait, never mind. Do this allure. Oh, okay, and then bye. Mario, wait, I'm warning you. You mustn't enter that door. You will be devastated. So, to et, I will be a fine. Luigi's gonna be banging the princess. Peace and Luigi. Mwah, mwah. Mario. What the fuck is going on here? Oh, Mario, you are here. It was exactly what it looks like, and there's shit all you can do about it, but Lee, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Yo, that was worth it. I'm very glad. I'm very glad I could. You know what? Even all the jank of that last section, the puzzle was incredible. Every level up to the last level was incredible. <laughs> now Mario has to take a walk of shame. Yeah. 10 for 10 ending. Uh, a solid 8 as is could potentially be a 9 with a patch, you know? <laughs> it's a little under 10 hours. It wasn't that bad, yeah. A little under 10 hours. Even with all the... the think of then, yeah. Oh my god, that was super funny. With the t did you put Sprys for Sprite? I think he was so excited to finish. Just missed some things. <laughs> Don't worry, I suck at spelling too. I would have got Sprites though, I will say. Did everyone say GG to Overcommon though? This is incredible. Grand Poo Bar. Oh, hey, hey, look it. Ryu is in there. Grand Poo Bear, Ryu, and me. Wait, post-game lore? Replay credits? I want post-game lore. It's very hot. Yeah, I want some post-game lore right here, is what I want. Let's get some post-game lore. I'm, I'm all about some post-game lore right here. Barb has to, yeah, Barb has to donate $5 now. Post-game lore. <laughs> Literally, it's a level called post-game lore. Yo, that Sonic ending sounds hot. Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> Mario walking alone with Luigi. Turns out Bowser had never taken Luigi in the first place. Instead, Peach had been cheating on Mario with Luigi, and the entire path to the castle was put together by Peach, Luigi, and Bowser. It was meant to destroy Mario. Or at least keep him away until Luigi and Peach were able to escape. Mario sounds like an overbearing ex-husband. 
There's still no knowledge on why Bowser helped Peach and Luigi. All we know is Peach has enough love to share. <laughs> Once Mario figured out what had happened, what had happened? He fell into a great depression, honoring dozens of Yoshi's daily as a coping tactic. This led to all the Yoshis turning against Mario, giving a huge bounty reward to whichever Yoshi brought back Mario's head. <laughs> Months later, this is not like a catching up. Months later, Peach and Luigi were able to escape from Bowser's castle as he was not letting them leave, as he felt he deserved more of a payment for helping them. Meanwhile, Mario, still unaware of his bounty, grows an unhealthy hatred towards Luigi, Peach, and Bowser, and starts to formulate a plan to extradite the thief from existence. To be continued. <laughs> Thank you so much for playing my game. I am not high enough for the post-game lore. Yeah. I am not... not nowhere near... Nowhere near high enough for post-game lore. I'd imagine he wrote that part. He he started when he was 14. He's 17 now. I imagine he... Some of you are high enough? Ooh. That hack was a roller coaster of emotions. At one point, it was like one of the most fun things I've played. It was like a, like a, you know, like a slightly harder quickie world. Then it goes like it shoots up. And it like shoots up as this incredible difficulty spike on the last two levels. As a stupid, amazing puzzle. Like, an incredible fucking puzzle, right? Just a really, really good puzzle. A uh, huge difficulty spike at the end. And a repeat boss. There's a roller coaster of emotions right there. I'm pretty happy I played it too. Yeah, so what did we miss in Yoshi's house? Like, over common. What, what did we brute force in the, in the, um, puzzle? There was a lot going on there. Yo, Overcommon, I have no doubt. I have no doubt that your next hack is going to be like an utter masterpiece, dude. I really believe that. This is this is a fine work of art. I think your next one's going to be incredible, an incredible masterpiece. I I the puzzle was incredible. Your I think you have a really good concept of flow. I think the only thing, I mean, really, like, the only real complaint was just, like, you know, small jank here or there. And then just the way the end. Wait, why is this not? Just the way the end went. I think I fucked it up, didn't I? This is the safety grid? Wait, how do I get up there? Oh, Yoshi spit it out, didn't he? Oh, he swallowed it? Wait, so... I'm gonna spit it out. Oh, I see. Level, okay. So, level five, level eight, level 12. Okay, so. What's that? R M T O S E R A R I. So this is a anagram. What's this anagram for? Overcommon. 
No, this is part of the first puzzle. We we brute we kind of brute force this. Oh, this is Super Mario Maker 2 right there. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah. We kind of brute force that. So yeah, how are you supposed to know that Yoshi's house had a false wall? All you gotta do is make a whole ROM hack and boom. Play, play my Wevel. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. It really helps the channel out. See you next time.